Okay, enough with the antics, Alex. Let's get the show on the road, okay? Thanks. All right, so first off, I'm gonna start by finger detangling my hair. I'm just gonna section it off and just finger detangle. Because that will lessen the shedding after you get done washing it. So that way when you comb it, you can just go right through it like you won't have a lot of shedded hair left over. Prevents breakage. products I'm going to use in my hair are this biotin shampoo don't really know what's all in it, it just was sulfate free so I got it Tresemme Naturals I love that stuff I will be using that as my leave-in as well as you know just regular conditioner and Africa's best herbal oil love that stuff and it's cheap and it gets the job done do you hear me do you hear me clips yay my faithful, faithful white tooth comb. Some gel my auntie gave me because I ran out. And my blow dryer. Love that thing. Okay, my hair is freshly washed now. And I'm just going to add the Tresemme Naturals to it. Remember, I'm using this as my leave-in. You can use whatever conditioner you would like as a leave-in. I use Cantu Shea Butter as well. Now I'm applying my herbal oil. And because I am using the blow dryer, I need a heat protectant, so I'm using Suave Heat Protectant. <laughs> I think it costs like a dollar or something. That's why I got it, and it gets the job done as well. Now I'm just combing through my hair. It's not um, that hard for me to get through because I did finger detangle at the beginning. So notice I'm just flying through it. Okay, so now I'm about to blow dry my hair. I don't remember what setting I had it on. I don't think, honestly, it really matters what setting you have it on as long as you have a heat protectant. I mean, that that's just my personal opinion. So just blow dry your hair. And I only blow dry like 50% dry because I do want to give my hair that full effect because I do not want my braid out to turn out really tight. And just too defined because as I stated before I don't like that so now I'm just parting the way that I want my hair to fall if you want it to fall in your face you know just part it you know make the braids fall in your face but if you want to go into the side part your hair to the side now I'm going to start braiding and 
And when you finish the braid, twirl the ends of your hair so that way the end curls and it'll look nice and neat. Okay, so I'm finished braiding my hair. These are the sides of it. So I'm just gonna let it dry overnight and I'll take it down in the morning.
guys, I loved how this braid out turned out. Sorry, I'm looking at myself. I love it. Like, I didn't even put that much in my hair. I mean, I wasn't going for a, like, super defined look. Because, like I said in my last video, I don't really like super, super defined looks. But, I'm, I mean, I like a little definition. Don't get me wrong. But, I mean, when it's not as defined, you get bigger hair. And it's already big, so I can just imagine day three is going to be even bigger and beautiful oh my gosh i love it like it turned out really good better than i expected all i used was gel and american what's it called oh american my bad africa's best herbal oil oh my gosh it turned out really good like i'm so happy you guys don't understand this is just giving me so much life like usually first day hair is just horrible for me like I hate first day hair but I will rock this without doing nothing to it boo just take it down and rock it yes ma'am yes ma'am all right I love it well thanks guys for watching see you in the next one